Trophy Cellar in Trophy Club, Texas, is a 541 bottle cellar created under a curved staircase. This space was previously only used for a storage room. Let's go over the original plans for the room. Here you see the overhead view. You can see that we have small racks on the two ends and a true radius curve racking along the back wall. Each elevation is designated by a letter, elevation A, elevation B, and elevation C. Let's start by looking at elevation A. Elevation A is the left wall as you enter the room. Here we have a solid X bin at the bottom, individual bottle racks in the center, and a reclaimed wine barrel tabletop above. The toe kick base molding is a standard one and a half inches high on all of the racks. Elevation B is our long curved back wall. The row above the tabletop to the left side holds 23 split size bottles. The next row is for large champagne size holding 16 bottles. We then have all 750 size individual bottle racks where the high reveal display row is shown. There's a light valance for the display row above the last two short rows on the right will hold 19 magnum bottles. The racks are a true radius and follow the curve of the wall. The upper part of the racks stair step down three steps then waterfall with the slanted ceiling. Elevation C is the right end wall. The upper horizontal display rack will fit two 750s or one magnum size bottle. Three solid bins below will hold wood cases or can be used for bulk storage. All of the custom racks are 13 and a half inches deep. The grill cover was custom made to fit over the wall mounted WM3600 split cooling evaporator. We added a vented lower area to house our LED drivers and allow access if needed. Here's an overhead 3D view of the cellar, outside view of the doors, back end walls, 3D drawing of the outside without a ceiling, the inside left view, outside doors again, inside right view, and looking at the front wall from the inside. Now let's take a look at the finished photos. Here are the double doors in Naughty Alder with early American stain and lacquer. A closer view of the custom iron design on the doors. We were asked to duplicate the iron design from an iron gate in another area of the home. Note that there are latches on the iron that allow for the iron to open for ease of window cleaning. Our client chose the Sonoma two-piece handle set and lock in oil rub bronze. The right handle set has the lock while the left is a dummy set. The interior includes a round knob. Here you see the front left corner of the room, the edge of the door, racking, tabletop, and grill cover. The end of the room with curved racks along the back wall. The racks were created in Naughty Alder with lacquer. The client chose to have a contrast in color when looking into the room from the darker stained doors. Here's a little better view showing the entire end and part of the back wall racks. The wine barrel tabletop and individual racks below. The back wall racks are fitted to the side racks and the high reveal display row begins. The tabletop is reclaimed wine barrel in the cooperage style. The markings are cooperage markings from the top and bottom of wine barrels. The grill cover is made to hide the evaporator coil and the LED drivers. It was made to match the racks. The end view with a few bottles of wine peeking out. Here's the true radius curved racks with a high reveal display row and LED lighting. The display row has true radius trim pieces above and below. This close-up of the trim shows wood pieces are different colors from different trees. The same color family, but different shades of wood make for a beautiful look when only lacquered. The back wall is all individual 750 racks with a display row. Close-up of individual racks shows the easy edges on the ladder rails. This helps prevent the bottle labels from tearing when placing bottles in the racks or removing them. Here's a straight on shot of the individual curved racks. The lighted display row up close. The top of the racks on the left side stair stepped down with the ceiling. The standard crown molding is shown at the top of the racks that are stair stepped. This shot shows the 4 inch recessed LED ceiling light over the first 
tall, flat ceiling area. The right wall photo shows two of the three wall-mounted lights that can be rotated to point where you wish on the opposite wall. The end rack contains a horizontal rack on top that slants with the ceiling and can hold either two 750 size bottles or one magnum size. The two end racks on the back wall also are sized for magnum bottles. The solid shelving below the horizontal rack are for wood case storage. They can also be used for bulk bottle storage. The final photo is a panorama shot to show you the cellar from top to bottom. Because it is a panorama, the racks do look a little bit oddly bent in places. That's just the way the photo looks. The trophy cellar is a beautiful addition to our client's home and they are thrilled with the results. For a custom wine cellar in your home, call Wine Cellar Specialists today.